Hey everybody, it's your girl Miss Info. We are here backstage at the Mark McNary show. That's Damon Dash, my old friend, making all noise right here. All of them right now. <laughs> um, well, Cam, tell me how you felt about it. Um, is this your first fashion show? Um, I was, I was asked. I really don't remember. I might have done one, but if I did do one, I don't remember. I, you know, I've been around for a while, as you know. But um, it was definitely a great experience working with Deidre and Mark. You know, I went in their office maybe last Thursday, so to get this quick turnaround and get it done so quick, it's amazing. Now. I actually brought you to the show right. last yeah. time, right? Yes. Um, and then now having gotten a taste of, of the high fashion scene, what do you feel like, you know, especially with the capes, what inspired the cape? Me, I mean, you know me, man. I've been trying, not trying, I've been different my whole career. If I see everybody wearing blue, I have to wear red. If everybody's wearing green, I have to wear yellow. So I try my best to stand out. You know, being around this long, you think of ways to reinvent yourself. And I just thought this would be fly. And uh when I bought it to Dame, he, he took it to Deidre, took it to Mark, and that's how it happened. Now, everybody actually thinks that you are launching a cape line. Mm -hmm. Given all of the reception, all of the, you know, great love that you're getting on it, do you, do you feel like you want to make that a reality? Uh, I mean, you know we have the clothing line now, uh, to say USA, so it's just something me and my team have to sit down and talk about and see if it makes sense for everybody. Okay. But for now, this is a one of one. Well, Mark made me four. You know, we, you know, I gave him the outline, and he came through with like the lumberjack, the camouflage, this one. So I got four to work with from Mark, and uh, it depends on the man. What I'm gonna do is, uh, what Deidre suggested, we gonna auction off one and see the response, and then we'll work from there. But what about the ladies? I mean, don't leave us out. I mean, you follow me on Instagram. You know, I got the lady capes. I got the crop capes for the ladies. They stop at the waist, so you can see the. A little bit of butt if you got one back there. So we got the crop capes and, you know, basically I got a bunch of capes for me. You know, I just got to see if I'm making for the people. Juju, uh, what was your reaction when you first saw Cam come out in a satin dipset cape? I was down with it. I like she it. She was like, you hot. <laughs> she was she's like, yo, that drink look kind of hot. Tell me exactly what you said. You was like. I want uh, one is what I said, a short one, and we made one for me. Well, further evidence that Juju is wifey of the year for sure. Number one girlfriend in hip hop, maybe in the world. Um, okay, so what's next? I know that you have a big deal with Karma Loop. I know that you know you have the capes that you might auction off. And what about musically? Uh, well, you know, I got the first of the month project coming out probably next month. Like it's done, I've just been weighing out the best options. They put together the eight track collaboration, which is called Federal Reserve. Me and Smoke got a project going on. And yeah, Smoke Dizzle got a project. It's like, five, it's like five different projects. It's just basically what we're doing now is trying to figure out timing for everything so everything makes sense. But it's probably like 150 new songs done. We're just trying to play, play some properly and get the timing nice. done. All right. Well, thank you guys for the great show and the interview. And, you know, I'll be, I'm watching y'all. I'm watching y'all. No, pre no, <laughs> no pressure, but. No, I already know. I feel a lot of pressure from my left side this whole time. <laughs> What are you going to do with this guy? Actually, I want to know one quick thing. Where did you guys meet? At the airport. Tell me that story. Well, I worked at the airport like 11 years ago um, before TSA came in, and he was coming through on business, and we met like that. Did you approach him, or did he approach you? He approached you? me. <laughs> it's the truth. What was the line? What was the line? He was like, um, Yo, I think you hot. Let me get your number. Something like that. I was like, okay. <laughs> Did you know who he was at the time? Yeah, I knew. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's where the love story started. Yeah, 11 <laughs> right. years ago. Well, I'm sure we'll see you on the runway again and again and again. And um, congratulations. Thank you.